Hello, welcome to your latest update for Scotland from the Met Office. Some sunshine around, but some heavy, thundery showers breaking out over the next couple of days, particularly in the southwest of the country. Slow moving, thundery showers dropping a lot of rain in a short space of time. Warnings are in place. There will be some places that just enjoy fine, warm, sunny skies the next couple of days. And the East Coast, always likely to see that mist and low cloud coming and going. The Ha uh, will be a feature of the weather, but um, plenty of sunshine in Shetland through the rest of Tuesday. Brightening up too across the Highlands, still a few showers here, but it's further south. The brighter colours there, that's why we're expecting some thundery downpours. Stumfries and Galloway Airship in particular. Not everywhere here catching those downpours, but where they do occur, they could drop a lot of rain in a short space of time that could cause some disruption, some uh, local flash flooding and some uh, interruptions to power supplies with the lightning. Elsewhere, generally dry and bright, but um, you could still catch one or two scattered showers. We'll see a bit more rain overnight tonight. The thundery showers drifting northwards and we could see some more developing across parts of the south and through the central belt especially during the early hours. Some uncertainty about that, but um, there could be quite a bit of wet weather across the uh, west, especially overnight. Temperatures holding up in double digits in most towns and cities, and the wind's relatively light. It means the mist and low cloud return overnight, so a grey start again across the east. The heavy, thundery showers should be pulling away, but then again, come the afternoon, any sunshine could spark some further downpours, and again, particularly across the southwest of the country, and again, slow-moving, intense thunderstorms, some hail mixed in with that. So again, that could cause some disruption. Elsewhere though, many places looking dry and bright for much of Wednesday. The mist and low cloud will move back to the coast, but some parts of the east coast and around the coast in the Northern Isles could just stay misty and murky all day. And as usual, that will have a big impact on the temperatures. If it stays misty and murky, low teens, but where we see some sunny spells, will be in the high teens, maybe into the uh, 20s again across the southwest. But there is the threat of those thundery showers. Continuing into Wednesday evening as well. So again, flashes of lightning, hail, downpours. They should ease away on Wednesday evening and Thursday looks a lot drier as well. Late in the day we could look at some wet weather coming up from the south, but Thursday overall looking dry and bright for much of the country. But again, parts of the east coast will be misty and murky and where that mist and low cloud persists, temperatures will struggle. A full UK forecast and the very latest details on the weather warnings available on the Met Office website or downloading our app or of course, make sure you're following us on social media.